Oh my god. <laughs> going on everyone Derek here today bringing you another video thank you guys so much for tuning back in guys today we have kind of an important video um, title and thumbnail might be a little misleading as of right now I decide all that when I sit down and edit but anyway guys so on today's agenda we have blue that's right we don't have the car right now Lucifer where have you gone so yes guys Lucifer obviously is not here at the house um, I also don't have the Camry. My dad's using that because something very unfortunate happened to my dad's truck. And I'm going to go ahead and show you guys that real quick. So I'm going to go ahead and make this segment really quick. Guys, this is my dad's 2010 Ford F-150. And when I sold Blue 2 Valve, you guys know that I got $13,000 cash for that car. So, you know, I went ahead and I took $1,000 and put it towards my dad's truck without him knowing. Now this was supposed to be a Father's Day gift to him, but we had so many packages coming to the house and he's not a dumb guy, I kinda probably gained some suspicion from it to be honest with you, especially cause I ordered stuff from like Truck World or something like that and yeah, he's the only one with the truck. So I went ahead and bought him the Raptor style front grill and we actually had to get it painted matte black um, because it came in like a gray, which we didn't like. And with that new grill, I had to go and match it up with these badass headlights right here. Everything is completely wired. And you know, with the headlights, we went ahead and got him some smoked LED tail lights as well. I went ahead and got him some of these, um, God darn it, what are these called? They're kind of like a fender flare type thing, and a lot of them are known for like the rivets. I didn't like that, and I want to say these are the Ford Raptor style, so went ahead and got him those. Something pretty simple, got him a black billet gas cap. It's pretty sick. And to top it off, guys, I went ahead and got him exhaust. Um, these things came with a single exhaust. Pretty shitty to be honest with you, so I went ahead and threw some flow masters on there, got him some four inch roll tips, and we got that installed. So now it is an actual true dual exhaust, and it sounds dead good but to sum it up guys this vehicle has only 50,000 miles on it and the transmission took a shit on them and it sucks because it is an automatic obviously and that's pricey so I'm letting my father use the Camry for however long he needs it because my car is obviously a car I can daily as far as today's video I had to drop the car off yesterday because I have that one last final piece before Mustang week and that was the tint job I had to get done now the car previously did have I want to say 35% tint and it looked good don't get me wrong but I want something where you know you can go completely incognito I got photos I got videos of it and oh my god I'm in trouble but I'm gonna go ahead and talk more about this once we get to the car um, as of right now I'm waiting on my friend Adam and you've seen Adam in plenty of my videos I don't know if he will have the Mustang with him today or if he's driving the truck um, not too sure but we have to run Go get some money and then we're gonna go pick up the car and you know from there we'll go ahead and just see what happens oh my uber looking all smart and stuff all right guys my uber is here let's go get this car first things first money then lance's house by the way there's trisha <laughs> <laughs> all right guys so we are pulling up it's this one right here with the jeep not sure where the car is it might be still in the garage but yeah, we're gonna go see what's up. Alright bro, I appreciate the ride, man. No problem, have a good one. We'll see you later. Do it for Derek. <laughs> Do it for Derek. <laughs> what's going on, man? How's it going, man? How you doing? I'm well, how are you? I'm doing good. It's been a crazy day at work. Alright guys, so we're gonna take a first look. That video you showed me was insane. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, it came out pretty nice. Wow, that looks real clean. Jeez. That looks awesome, man. It's exactly how I wanted it. So you guys can see, went ahead and we applied some 5% tin on there um what would you say about 35 on that last film roughly about 30 i guess about 30 so i went ahead and got the five percent because one you can clearly see that i'm going with the blue and black color scheme once again and you know that black window just on the blue paint it really makes that blue paint pop even more and you know we went ahead and did my little favorite windshield banner five percent as well the last time i got a windshield banner was on the two valve and i had it for about a week and then a rock hit the windshield had to get a whole new windshield and i just never really worried about it after that but Hopefully this doesn't happen with this one. Pretty well known around Richmond for tinning. You can find me at Lance's Window Tinning or just search me on Facebook, uh, Lance Ragsdale. Um, if you search any of the forums like 
Richmond Cars and Coffee, or RV AC. Oh yeah, you were really recommended. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's all over the place, you know. I just try to do a really good job for a fair price. I'm trying to kill anybody on price, but at the same time, I'm trying to make a dollar at 15 cents. Yeah, of course, but, of course. Um, like I said, I've been doing it for 25 years. And I offer a non-ceramic and ceramic product. Um, you know, I do front windshields and banners, full blackout cars and you name it, I can do it. All right, guys, so I am gonna go ahead and link his social medias and stuff in the description so it's a lot easier for you guys to find. Definitely hit him up. Like he said, super well-known around Richmond for tinning. I've been getting recommendations about him for the longest time, especially with my old car. And yeah, he's the guy to go to, especially if you're local to Richmond, so. Pretty stacked with appointments. Yeah, probably about a good three weeks. You guys got about three weeks, so I would plan right now. But yeah, man, it looks absolutely incredible. Super satisfied with it. I mean, it's gonna be fun driving with the windows up around here, I'll tell you that much. Let's go ahead, take a seat and see what it looks like from the inside. Oh, oh yeah, that's dark. Dang, I love it, guys. I don't know how well you can see me, but you know, you can see a respectable amount outside, but when you come and look from outside in, it looks like you're literally looking at a black mirror. I mean, what's next? 5% on the windshield, full way? <laughs> But I'm gonna go ahead and get the car pulled out, finish up, and we'll pick this video right back up. Well, man, I appreciate it again. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. And hopefully, you know, get some emails, but I know you're booked, so. <laughs> I'll let you know how it goes on the way home, too. Who knows? Maybe I'll be that lucky guy to get the first ticket on the way home. Yeah, yeah. lucky you. <laughs> but it looks incredible, dude. Awesome work. All right, guys. Wow, it's so dark in here. I love it. Woo! All right, now we gotta get this thing home and hopefully get home with no tickets. <laughs> Fuck, this is dark. All right, let's do it. So yeah guys, we just picked up the car from Lance's, 5% um, tint all around, you can kind of see, it's pretty damn dark, but I must say, Lance is one good dude, guys. He is honestly so good at his craft, like this tint job is probably one of the best I've ever had on any vehicle of mine, and I'm, I'm just super satisfied with it. Alright, let's not draw any attention, that wouldn't be too- ah! Yo fam, Loki, check that out. Almost at that 100k, let's go, subscribe! Oh, there's a spot. Let's go ahead and air this thing out. I'm anxious to see what it looks like from the outside now. All right, let's take a look. Oh. Yeah, it's still pretty bright out. Dang, guys. This looks freaking amazing. 5% all around, and actually, the rear is 3%. I want it to go completely black on the rear, so that's 3%, the rest is five. All right, guys, so went ahead and just got gas. That's completed. And while I was getting gas, I actually just remembered something super cool. So, guys, many of you might already know this, but recently I just partnered with a super cool brand called Ridge Wallets. Now, what Ridge Wallets are, they're wallets for minimalists. As you guys can see here, I have this small, compact carbon fiber wallet, and you might be asking, well, where do you put everything? And it's a pretty simple answer. You can fit a lot in here. You also have this super cool little push tab here where it gives you access to your cards and on the other side you can see I have the money clip with some cash clip to it. It's a super cool compact wallet guys and I highly recommend them not only because I'm partnered with them but this is actually a product I have been interested in for a while. So if you want to go ahead and grab yourself one of these Ridge wallets head to the link in the description there will be a link there and use promo code DBP squad for 10% off and guys I promise you you'll never look back to a big bulky leather or you know velcro wallet again. So go get yourself one and remember DBP squad as your promo 
promo code. But other than that, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and head home before the storm hits. And overall, I'm just so excited. Mustang week is almost here. Oh my God, I just remembered too. I have something so cool to show you. Um, yeah, the merch came in. Let's go take a look. Uh, I'm a flight risk. I don't think they're ready for the shit. These things came out amazing. Like the detail, the ink. Man, you guys are gonna love these. I mean, look, I just cracked the box open and Sky is over here already checking it out. And remember guys, only 100 of these shirts. So get ready. But all right guys, that's gonna go ahead and conclude today's video. The last step to the Mustang Week list. The car is officially done for Mustang Week that is. After Mustang Week, that's when we're gonna go and crack into the you know, full bolt-ons and all that stuff and change up a ton with this car, which I'm looking forward to as well. But in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy it because it's come a long way. Take a look. <laughs> oh my God. Wow. Oh my, it looks so much better in person. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy crap, man. Oh, dude, this, this is amazing. And now, whoop-bam, that's where we're at, guys. Lucifer is looking good. But with that, guys, we're gonna go ahead and wrap up today's video. Remember, if you enjoyed, make sure you drop a like, drop a comment with any questions or concerns. If you wanna say what's up, that's cool too. And today's EBP vlog shout out is going out to Vanny Two Valve. Thank you so much for your continued support. Make sure you guys go check him out on Instagram. And for those of you who want to just want a shout out on the vlogs, make sure you follow me on Instagram at Derek Brand Productions and use hashtag DBP school to know your post. As you guys know, every time I film a video such as this one, go to hashtag to use it and boom, shout out. Guys, remember if you want to copy merch, make sure you're ready Mustang week. They're gonna go quick, only 100 of them. Starting this Friday, that will be day Day one of Mustang week it's pretty much gonna be the prep and I'm just gonna film the whole entire journey start to finish so be ready click this bell notification icon so whenever I post you're ready to go with that guys thank you again so much for watching we will see you Friday for a fresh video but until next time I'll see you later yeah.